Welcome to the morning prayer meditation. This is simply a prayer I've put together where I'd like to pray for anyone within the sound of my voice. All I ask you to do is to agree with me as I pray, and together we will seek our Heavenly Father. Please continue to meditate on this prayer for yourself, speak it daily, or listen to this over and over again, and allow the Word of God to reach deep into your spirit. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, we gather together and come into agreement in the wonderful and powerful name of Jesus. Where two or more are gathered, there you'll be in the midst of us, and anything we agree upon is touching, you will surely do. The Bible says if there's any unforgiveness, that it should be dealt with before praying. Therefore, we release any anger, bad feelings, resentment, or any other wrong attitude before you now. We lay it at your feet, and we release and forgive those who have wronged us. Father, in Jesus' name, there's no distance in the Spirit, and we thank you for the listener who desires a morning prayer meditation. We thank you for this day that you've given us. We lift you up, Almighty God. Together we exalt you, the Most High. You are our strength and our shield. Praise you forever. We look to you as our source. Our heart trusts in you. With a song we shall thank you. With our hands we will lift you up. You, Father, are amazing. We are abiding in your word. It is ever before our eyes. It is even planted in our hearts. We are holding fast to your teachings and living in accordance with them. We worship you and we lift you up. We magnify you. Hallelujah. Our tongues shall declare your righteousness and your praise all day long. Bless you, Lord. Bless you, Lord. Bless you, Lord. We thank you, Father. We bless your holy name. Father, we bless you and we will not forget any of your benefits. Apart from you, we can do nothing. But thank you that we are never apart from you. We are vitally connected. You will never leave us. We desire to be your true disciples. Help the listener, Father, to be that. We are abiding in the vine, and we bear fruit, Father, only because of you. And we give you the glory, and we give you the praise for that fruit. All that we have is yours. All that is good came from you, Father. You are the vine, and the listener is a branch living in you. We declare that the listener bear much fruit for your glory. We declare that, Father, that they live today, the listener lives today in strength, empowered by the Holy Spirit. Your son Jesus said, if you live in me and my words remain in you and continue to live in your hearts, ask whatever you will and it shall be done for you. When the listener bears much fruit in their lives, Father, as we mentioned, you get the honor, you get the glory. We decree and declare that the listener is fruitful in whatever they put their hands to, Father, as they're led by your spirit. By your grace, Father, that we have received, the listener will show and prove themselves to be a true follower of your son Jesus as they're empowered and led by the Holy Spirit. We thank you that the love, Father, for the listener that you have is everlasting. We pray that the listener would abide in that love, Father, that they would live in that love. Father, we will continually offer up a sacrifice of praise to you, God, for you alone are worthy. The fruit of our lips will give thanks to your name. Lord, thank you. Thank you for your word. The truth will make the listener free. We praise you, Father, that your nature abides in the listener. Help the listener, Father, to hide your word in their heart that they might not sin against you. We pray that Christ, through the listener's faith, Father, would actually dwell in their heart. It is our desire to be rooted deep in your love and founded securely on your love, Father, and have the strength, the ability to, to comprehend, to understand, Father, the magnitude of your love towards us. We will praise your name forever. We will sing to you, Lord, as long as we live. We will sing praise to you while we have our being. We pray that we may know this love, Father, this love you have for us that surpasses knowledge, that we may be filled, Father, to the measure of all your fullness. Oh, give thanks to the Lord. We call upon your name. We will make known your deeds among the peoples. Great are you, Father, and highly to be praised. Your greatness is unsearchable. Father, to you who are able to immeasurably do more than we could ever ask or even imagine to say, Father, in this prayer, according to the power that is work within us, Father, to you be the glory in the church and in Christ Jesus throughout all generations forever and ever. We thank you and praise your glorious name. We thank you for strengthening the listener with power from on high. We thank you for this day that you have given us. Worthy, worthy, worthy is the Lamb. We believe and receive everything we've prayed and declared and give you glory in advance, for this prayer is heard and answered. In the wonderful and precious name of Jesus, we pray. Amen.